the hacksaw. Hacksaw is a very specific type of handsaw for cutting metal. You notice this blade looks a little different. It actually has this little set of ridges that go all the way down it and very fine tooth. They have adjustment in the frame to where you can tighten it on this one. It tightens here. The blade just hangs in two little teats, one at the bottom, one at the top. You lock the handle down and you tighten it with tighten, twist this back in place to tighten it. And using a hacksaw, it can be a little difficult and they're kind of hard to start. So we're gonna cut a little one-inch piece a couple different ways. A quick down and dirty measurement from the end of your last finger joint is almost always roughly an inch on pretty much anybody. If you want to make a measurement it's real quick and it doesn't have to be over accurate, or you can take out a tape measure, mark it at an inch, and guess what? It's dead on. Starting a hacksaw. As I showed you before with a PVC saw, I like to start the blade against my thumb against the tip in this first joint, and I'm gonna draw it back several times until it gets cut into the to the metal. Then once you get it, think you've got it started, you can try the sawing action. It's usually easier to hold the one piece because you want to lessen it all the vibration you can. Because this will take a little bit and it was prone to getting stuck. Don't be surprised if you dig and it stops. You have to work it free, lay it back in the kerf you made, drag it back a few times to get it cleaned up. And just like a handsaw, when you get to the end, you gotta remember to brace yourself in the last stroke because it's gonna fall away, usually. This time it didn't. And if you look at this little cut, it's got a lot of burrs around the edge. And that's what we use a deburring tool to clean it up on the metal pipe. This right here is a steel pipe. It's, it's actually electrical pipe, but we're using it to cut for the demonstration. This is a hacksaw. 